Okay, so the first thing you're going to do is write your name on your paper. Then you are going to draw a long rectangle and break that up into four Well, let's break it up into five spaces. Next, you're going to draw four squares. We have three across and then one down. And four circles. On this top one, label it value scale. And this one, hard edge, soft edge. Dry brush. and lifting. These are going to be mixing. So once you have your worksheet created, you're going to use the watercolors at your table. You can kind of see these aren't all full. So that means that you don't get one set, you're sharing them with people at your table. And for right now, it doesn't really matter what color you get, so you're just going to pick one. A value scale is where it's one color and it goes from light to dark. So I'm going to start over here. So in the meantime, I'm going to do a soft edge over here, get some more red, and immediately paint back in with some blue next to it. So with a softer edge, you can see they're bleeding together right now, and a soft edge is making it fuzzy, okay? And it'll make it hard to read, hard to be able to tell what's going on there but sometimes you want an effect like that. The next box here that's called dry brush, I use some orange. So I've got just a tiny little bit of water in my brush, not much at all. I'm twirling my brush around and I'm just gonna get some color like that. So it's not very much water in your brush at all. And then painting on the paper without the paper being wet. And lastly for the mixing, say you want a new shade of something. Maybe I want a yellow or green. I'm going to put some green down. Okay, for color lifting, I'm going to get a new color here. And I'm just going to add some, a couple of colors, I guess. You want to kind of have a lot of, some more water on this, than we, a lot more than we did the dry brush. If you wad up a paper towel, you can lift sections off of it. And just see what you get. 